welcome back to another Carter Steam Fair vlog. Yeah, it won't be a mega long vlog. Again, it's just purely to show you what's here uh, and where we are because it's a brand new ground for us. Uh, we've done, well, this will be the 16th vlog I've done from a Carter Steam Fair, but I've never been to Malden before, which is in Essex. Uh, it took us about an hour and a half to drive here. It's just between Southend on Sea and Clacton, so just in between, but yeah, the location is uh, Promenade Park. I thought I'd get this little vlog out. I'll probably do the dodgems and the skid, you know, the usual rides I like going on. I've still got some free tokens in my bag uh, from when we went to Pickney's Green. Uh, them two vlogs went down really well from Reading and Pickney's Green. The, the last ever locations for this amazing fun fair, as you know, if you don't know. Carter Steam Fair, um, Joby Carter's selling up at the end of the year, so if they can't find a permanent ground, then it'll be uh, sold off to whoever wants to buy it. Um, and, but this is the last time they'll be at uh, these locations. So yeah, we're at Promenade Park in Malden, and it's on this weekend, 21st and the 22nd of May, and then it's on for the 28th of May, which is next weekend, till the 5th of June. So I think it's on till that, that whole week because it's the Queen's Jubilee. Uh, don't know if they're doing any promotions or anything for that, but um, if not, follow him on Facebook, Carter Steam Fair on Facebook. It's dead easy. It does like lo loads of live videos and always uploads stuff. There is free fireworks tonight. I don't know if there's fireworks next weekend. Um, it just says free fireworks. It doesn't actually say what days they are on. Uh, but never mind. We're here. Uh, we're, here. we're not here long. It's just gone three o'clock. We'll probably be here about an hour or so. Again, we've got Tilly with us, but the location is really, really nice down here, just next to the estuary here. Uh, like this big duck pond in the middle, and all this slow, there's a fish and chip shop, ice cream stalls, loads of people. We parks like way over there on the Ringo car park or council car park. And we've just walked up here. I owe silver lining. Right, let's go and uh, have a look at some rides at Carter's. I don't think the uh, I, don't, I don't think the octopus is out quite yet, but the ground again. Like I said on every single vlog, Carters have some of the best grounds um, on the fair circuit. They really do. This ground's amazing. I don't know if any other showmen uh, come here on this ground or not. But it's absolutely amazing. Uh, Carters have been going since the 1970s, and they've been at the same grounds ever since. Apparently they did go to Alton Towers once, but yeah, when we walked up I thought, oh my god, it's rammed, but it's not. There's no queue for the skid. I'll have a quick walk around first. It's more of a, more of a long set-up this time. We've got the ice cream van, the dodgems over there, the skid just here. Nearly walked over to Tilly, and I'm going to get copyrighted. <laughs> You got the chair of plane or the chair swing in the middle. Oh, it is a chair of plane, yeah, the chair of plane. Oh my god. I don't think Wayne, yeah, it's not Wayne's on there. Scott's on it today. My mate Scott. Yeah, hold tight. Yep. Yeah. You got all your game stalls, food stalls around there. Again, every time you come, it's always a different setup. You know, I mean, yeah, it's the same ride, but it's in a different location. Uh, the actual setup of the grounds, totally different every time you come. Got the juvenile rides down here in the middle. And there's your token booth. The steam gallopers. Beautiful rides. Your mini octopus over there. Got the little train. It's beautiful. What a lovely day as well. Really, really nice. We had nothing planned at all this weekend. Again, I, I, I didn't know if I was going to work today. I'd only wait until Friday afternoon, and I'll I get a phone call to see if I can work a Saturday. But I didn't get anything. Uh, steam yachts. And the supersonic jets, that's your lot. Same ride look as the last two fares. But there's no one on it, there's no queue at all. And there's what, six or seven people on the ride? Yeah, 
it's a lot quieter than it was last time at Pickney's Green. I think they were actually somewhere else before this ground. Not quite sure. Oh yeah, um, yeah, somewhere else. It wasn't far away. I can't remember the name. Something Green. I can't remember. I've been to that ground. What I wanted to do was try and get to the grounds that I've not done before. Um, so the other ones, Litchfield, I've not done before. But I'm still waiting for the octopus to come out. Yeah, I'll go over and do the dodge first. I'll do a couple of rides. Yeah, really nice setup out. Everything's round the outside. I like that. And again, it's so clean as well. Bins everywhere. Yeah, it's, it's a lot quieter. <laughs> There's no queue for this, well there is a little bit, there's no one waiting for the dodgems at all. Yeah, I'll get you an ice cream. I hope they take card. <laughs> oh, oh well, there was, well, there wasn't a queue. some of the free cards as well I'll do this I'll do the skid and then maybe have another quicker walk around I can't hear myself thinking here <laughs> sitting on a chaise long short chaise long all day long oh here we go here we go oh get around there get around there ah yeah good shoot fresh potato
awesome ride there on the supercar Dodgems. Yeah, really, really good. I don't know what it is, but I all seem to get really slow ones. Right, so straight off to there, straight onto the lightning skip. to wait for riders to fill the ride up. That means let go. Hey! Push it down now, hold it down, there skip the car, and then release. Push it down, skip the car to the left, and then release. Yeah, he 
had to stop it, I don't know if you can hear me on the right, but yeah, he had to stop it and adjust it. Uh, the, the block underneath, it's basically when you press the pedal, there's a block that hits the ground, which sort of makes it go to one side and then you release it and it goes to the other side. It just wasn't getting that friction. Uh, what we're doing as well now, we've got a new tradition. I know Sloppy Vlogs does the same thing with, with Libby, but we've got to do it with Tilly. We did a hooker duck uh, last weekend in, um, at um, Tier Prince, Funland Tier Prince. Uh, well, Lisa did the hooker duck and won a teddy for Tilly, and she's not let go of it since we got it for her last week. So we've got to do hooker ducks if we can. There's some good stuff on it, but they don't take the free tokens. We're going to have to get some more tokens. We've, we've spotted the, uh, well, it's not even exactly the, uh, the hardest hooker duck. <laughs> You've got, to use the, you've got to use the pole, even though you can, any, anyway, it's not the point. But yeah, you've got some Star Wars characters up here. I really like the Bob and Fett, but we've seen these, these are quite cute. These little foxes. So yeah, you get a prize every time. So I've got to go and get a, a token, even though it's three pounds. I think they're worth three pounds for sure. So I'll go and get some tokens, but yeah, <laughs> it's like... <laughs> Sort of defeats the object of having a stick for hooking a duck. Where you, you can just grab it off the side. But yeah, never mind. Yeah, it's quite quiet actually today. And, um, it's, it's one of those things. We're hoping that not everyone thought that Pickney's Green was their last fair. And they all went to Pickney's Green and then that was it. Not bothered going to any other Carter's fair. So it's pretty quiet. We didn't didn't really have to... Well, there's no wait for any of the rides. I mean, that's going around with one person on the whole ride, I can't believe it. Uh, yeah, and it's very short queue for the uh, tokens, so I'll get the tokens for the hooker duck, do the hooker duck, win, uh, win Tilly a prize. You want a teddy? Do you want another new teddy? Yeah, she loves teddies. We actually, uh, the first one we ever got her when she was a puppy, we actually took it off her. Uh, we found that, well, we're not found out, what she tends to do is, if she eats something, she'll go and grab a teddy and then she runs upstairs crying with a teddy for attention, like she wants you to play with her. If we ignore her, she goes she goes and runs upstairs with a teddy in her mouth crying. So yeah, she's got like a, 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 a load of toys. She, she hardly plays with half of them. But teddy, she goes, um, she goes crazy for teddies. But anyway, <laughs> I get the token from the beautiful cash token box. Yeah, I've got me one token, <laughs> three pound. Uh, one duck, red on the bottom is any prize. Blue is from the first two shells. Can I not just pick it off the shelf? Go for it if no, you want No, yeah, no, it defeats the object, <laughs> doesn't it? Yeah. I'm having a Bruce really fun. long pole. <laughs> hey, look her. Tilly! Tilly, do you want Teddy? Do you want Teddy? <laughs> uh, I've never done one before, here Tilly. we go. Yay! That's a one. blue one, so that's anything off the front oh. two shells. Oh, that's alright, that's what we wanted. Right, here we are. Oh. Yay, here we are, Tilly. Oh yeah, can you pull the oh, yeah. plastic off? I think that's... Yeah, uh, one there as well. Have uh, you got it? Oh. Almost. Bag. She'll have it later, it is a bit warm. Right, go and do one more ride, I think. Go and do the uh <laughs> no, she's not bothered, is she? <laughs> Put it in my bag. Oh well. Yeah, it's worth three pounds. Would have rather have had the Boba Fett, but I don't think she's into Star Wars as much as me. There's Joby. Oh, just nice to see Joby. Uh, just had a chat with Joby Carter again. It's nice when he comes up and he knows who you are. I think that's really nice, but he's bound to know who I am now. I always go up and say hello. 
it's probably fed me uh, pestering him. Uh, but yeah, just watch this space. Uh, I know a lot of people have asked about doing meetups and things. Um, I'm, I'm going to be talking with Joby Carter. I did mention it just a minute ago to him. Uh, I'm thinking about doing a meetup for the last ever Carter Steam Fair, which will be in Reading at the end of the year. Uh, so if you're interested, obviously comment down below. We're going over to do the Jets. I said I was coming. <laughs> Yeah, I said I was coming, didn't I? Well done, you did. Luff, you Loughborough. 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 <laughs> oh, I'm getting tangled. That's it, you're all right. You're all right. You're on the telly now. <laughs> I got on the ride. <laughs> yeah, supersonic jets. Are you staying over? No, this is it. Just one more last ride. No, no, I mean, are you staying over? Staying over? Yeah. Are you coming for the day? No, nah, no, nah, I've just come for the day. Oh, yeah. Best yeah. place yeah. to be. It's lovely ground, it isn't it? Lovely. lovely. Have you better to walk along the pub? Yeah, we'll do in a minute with, a with the dog. Cream. Yeah, it's Are you nice. coming on then? Yeah, I'm coming on, yeah. Of course I'm coming on. One of my favourite rides here. Supersonic Jets. Yeah, you also got the swings behind me as well, but yeah, it is a lovely ground here. Look at her, she's even got a skirt on. <laughs> That's quite rare, isn't it? Yeah, getting my legs up. Look, they're so close. <laughs> that's the green. Yeah, it's all right, cheers. Yeah, it is a beautiful ground here. Really, really pretty. I'll uh, just get another another picture. Yeah, very quiet at the moment. Got another picture. It's beautiful ground. Got some pictures for me thumbnails. Follow me on Facebook. You're a fan of the channel, then? Yeah, there you are, he's a fan of the channel. <laughs> well, it's got on the jets. Hey, here we go, supersonic jets. Yeah, the lad behind me, he's not just a fan of the channel. <laughs> he actually lives in Malden. She just told me he was helping set up the ground and everything this morning. Here we go. Oh, what a beautiful ground it really is. They picked the best grounds ever. It's such a shame that they're uh, they're not going anymore after this year. Look at that view. It would have been amazing to see a full lineup of rides at one of these fairs because I just haven't seen it for the whole time I've been vlogging. You know, there was rumours of like the dive bomber coming back, which it did. That was amazing. I did the dive bomber a couple of times. But then um, I went to one, it was Basingstoke. Um, I can't remember if it was last year or not. Um, I think it was the year before, well, I think it was before lock, the year before lockdown. And they had Basingstoke, they had a, the funny mirrors, they had the ghost train, they had uh, the dive bomber. They had all of these rides that were here. And then another time they'll obviously take one of the rides off the circuit to, uh, to do it up, so. At the moment, the, uh, the the arc's not with them at the moment because that's been done up. The octopus is still not finished, so still not been on the uh, the octopus. Uh, obviously, he's sold the dive bomber, and they do ha he does have a small Ferris wheel as well, which I've never seen. So it would have been amazing, but it's just so much effort and cost to bring it all out. That's you know, you can't keep it, you can't do it forever. And they're really short-staffed at the moment. So if you want a part-time job, or even full-time, contact them, Carter Steam Fair, because they're desperate for staff at the moment. Get yourself on one of these. And apparently they, they, they pay all right. I did ask someone, but I'm not gonna obviously disclose how much he's getting paid. But yeah, it's all right. If you're a, you know, a, young, a young teenager or whatever, you want to work on the hooker duck or one of the rides. I think you might have to be over 18 to operate the rides. And obviously some of them are operated by a different showmen. This is owned by the girl <laughs> in there and her husband. So you wouldn't be working on here. But yeah, absolutely stunning ground. I think we're going to get some chips in a minute. Absolutely gorgeous. It's probably the, other than Pickney's Green, I think this is my second favorite ground that I've been to. Saying that, they're all just as good as each other. I really like uh, Basingstoke as well, the Mo War Memorial Park, that's a really good ground as well. Um, the one in uh, Bath, that was a nice ground as well. But please check them out on the website, it's Carter Steam for, for the calendar of where they're going to. 
uh, all the merchandise if you want to work for them as well remember they are finishing at the end of the year so I'll get it in quick and saying that I might even work for them at West Wickham because it's literally just on the road from where we live might work a Sunday for them because they're very short staff but yeah I love the supersonic jets right there you go that was my final ride here at uh, Malden Right, there you go, uh, last one ride there on the supersonic jets. Love that ride, in fact I love all the rides here. It's just a bit of an effort going on the steam yachts, especially when you got a hold on it's really hard to film as well unless you use a chest harness. I'm going to have to move away from this organ here because I got copyrighted on it last time. <laughs> but yeah, very nice fare. It's getting a little bit busier now. Uh, fireworks tonight. And then they're on again at the last weekend, and then between the with the first, like the beginning of June, they're here every day uh, for nine nine days. Uh, so check out the website. Um, yeah, please come down and support the car of Steam Fair because they really need it now, especially with the news that we had a couple of weeks ago of them finishing all. It's really sad. Um, this has been a really good ground. Yeah, I could have gone on. A couple more rides, could have done the yachts and the uh, the gallopers and the, probably the cheriplane. But that's about it really. Uh, I'm, waiting. I'm waiting for the octopus to come out. I really am. I, I want to get that in before before anything. Tilly spotted me. Hello! Oh, she's jumped right up to me. <laughs> Tilly! Hello! Come on then. Are we going now? Are we going now? Good girl. Right, that's it. Uh, another car to stay at. I got a good background. She's got to follow me. She's like, good background in the shade. There you go. Not quite in the shade. There you are. Kite <laughs> Steam Fair. Please come and support them. If you've never been to one, I know so many people that comment on videos, not just these ones, but any video, and go, oh yeah, that place looks amazing. I'd love to go. And then they never do. But, you know, please come out and have a, have a go, even if you just. Even if you just come out for a day out and have a walk around. But yeah, Cart Steam Fair in uh, Malden in Essex here till the 5th of June. It's on this weekend and then the following weekend it's here till nine days, I think. Um, but there you go, another Cart of Steam Fair, the 16th vlog from Cart of Steam Fair. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell for next time I upload another video. And I'll see you in another car of Steam Fair, which I don't know which one. I'd, I'd like to go to the one in Leechfield, and then maybe the one at the end of the year, and then that'll be it. There's a few more. There's West Wickham, which I'll probably do because it's just up the road from where I live. And um, yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now. <laughs>